What will houses be made of in the future? The process of making cement produces 5% of all global greenhouse gas emissions. So some of our observers have set about trying to find an alternative. They've come up with some more environmentally friendly building materials, which we featured in our Observers Take Action series. Our observer, Moussa Tiam, is from Mali and is doing a PhD in chemistry at the University of Ottawa in Canada. He thinks that he's developed a new type of cement that is just as strong as concrete. Là, c'est un résultat de nos travaux complètement composé que les plastiques, les déchets, évidemment, le gravier et le sable. On a fait les caractérisations de nos graviers et sable, puis on a bien conditionné les matériaux plastiques. Ensuite, on est passé à l'étape du four, à une très haute température, puis coulé dans nos moules spécialisés, ça nous donne ce produit final. Moussa hopes that his material will soon be used to build roads and pavements in West Africa. In Colombia, 7 million people have been displaced by an armed conflict that has been going on for over 50 years. And so our observer, Oscar Mendez, created Conceptos Plasticos, a company that builds homes entirely out of recycled objects. The company has recycled 160 tons of plastic in two years, which has let them build 15 houses a month for families without a home. And best of all, it's cheap. Our observer's goal is for his idea to be used to help displaced people all over the world. Our final invention is somewhat surprising. Bricks made out of paper. Our observer Elijah Jan in South Africa got the idea when he saw his father burning unwanted school textbooks. He wanted to turn the paper into something useful, so he worked out a way to transform it into a building material. Elijah has done the tests and his paper bricks are both waterproof and strong. What's more, his achievement has been recognised. He's just won first prize in an innovation competition in Johannesburg.